Hello friends, I am Tushan Dakal. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to learn about the difference between primary memory and secondary memory. Primary memory are those memory which are volatile in nature except ROM and secondary memory are those memory which are non-volatile in nature. So they are used for permanent storage and primary memory. Now let's see the difference. Primary memory is also called main memory, internal or system memory. Uh, but secondary memory is called as auxiliary memory. It is not the main memory. It is the auxiliary memory which is used to store a huge amount of data. So it is also known as mass storage device, external memory or backup memory. The second difference is it was data program information which are currently under execution. But it will data program and information permanently. Means we store data permanently for future use in secondary memory. It is directly accessible to CPU. Primary memory is directly accessible to CPU. But secondary memory is not accessible to CPU. So it requires primary memory for its operation. For read and write operation. Without primary memory, the secondary memory cannot access. So, it requires primary memory for its operation. Primary memory is usually volatile memory except ROM. Volatile means those memory which stores data for a short period of time or until the power is on, on state. Power supply is on state. After the power supply is off, all the data is stored in primary memory losses. That's why it is volatile in nature. But secondary memory stores data permanently for the future use. The data is stored in secondary memory are not lost if the power supply is off. So it is not volatile in nature and we cannot carrying data or we cannot carry data from one computer to another using the primary memory. So it cannot be used for carrying data from one computer to another. But secondary memory are used to transfer data from one computer to another. So we can transfer data from one computer to another computer using secondary memory. We use pen drive to transfer data. We use external hard disk to transfer data. We can transfer data by using secondary memory. But by using primary memory, we cannot transfer the data. Primary memory is usually expensive on per, per bit cost. But it is cheaper on per bit cost. It is faster for read-write operation. Primary memory are faster for read-write operation. But secondary memory are slower for read-write operation. Because secondary memory requires primary memory for its operation. That's why it is slower. It is used in smaller storage capacity in PC. Primary memory. We use primary memory in smaller storage capacity. But a huge amount of data. To store a huge amount of data, we use secondary memory. That's why it is used in larger storage capacity in PC. It is on the top level of memory hierarchy. Memory hierarchy. In memory hierarchy, the top level is register. Register is the fastest memory. After register, cache memory. Cache after RAM. So, RAM, cache memory are in the top level of memory hierarchy. But secondary memory hierarchy are in the low level of the memory hierarchy. Primary memory, it is the part of motherboard. We attach in motherboard, but it is external media. So, it is the external media attached to the motherboard. A-T-T-A-C-H-E-D attached to the motherboard. Example, RAM, ROM, cache memory are primary memory. Hard disk, magnetic tape, floppy disk, pen drive, 
CD, DVD, Blu-ray discs. These are the example of secondary memory. So this is the difference between primary memory and secondary memory. If you have not subscribed my channel, do not forget to subscribe the channel to get the updated videos. Thanks for watching the video.